Hey, Smitch, you need a survival. We're gonna work on our bow drill today. They're on a hurricane. I'm gonna put a piece of birch bark down to give myself a surface for my ember to land on. Okay, so I'm just tweaking my tinder bundle, which happens to be made out of cattail and jute twine. And this is why I tell all my students to always carry enough material to make a tinder bundle that's gonna be dry. You can carry somewhere in your rucksack, on your person, whatever the case is. I'm going to put a wet leaf inside my handhold to reduce some of the friction. It's imperative. Nothing touches the ground that I want to start my fire with. Okay, so I noticed that my, my bow was getting a little loose on me. I'm gonna tighten it up, go for the ember. Get a little dust pile down there. Hopefully it'll ignite for me. Let's see if we can get an ember. Pressure's on, it's raining, it's dark. It's a hurricane. I can't even see my pile it's so dark. Let's see if we can get an ember. Alright, well my kit broke off right here at the edge, so I made my spindle a little narrower, and now I'm starting another spot on my hearth, so I can try again. Just working on my depression, so my spindle has a place to sit. You know, when you do enough of these, you can do them in the dark, during hurricanes, whatever the case is. It's not a big to-do. It only takes a minute to carve it. It just has to give a spot for my spindle to not slide away when I initially start bowing in the first place. And I start spinning my spindle. Alright, this is basically done. Just 
just feeling it with my thumb to see what spot needs to be brought down a little bit to make a nice, nice little depression for it. Okay, let's try it again. First thing I need to do is burn it in. Then I'll go for my amber. All right, it's good burning. I'm gonna carve my notch. Go for my amber. All right, so I know it's really dark. You have to hang in, hang in with me here. Let's see if we can get this going. Notch is cut. Got some dust from last time. Let's see if we can make an ember and blow it in flame. Ember. All right, looks like we got an ember. Excellent. This has not been easy. I'm gonna put it right in my bundle. Okay, it just fell. Picking it up. Putting it right in my bundle. Very small ember. Not much to it. See if I can coax it to life. Maybe you guys can see it. No. Let's see if I can coax it to life here. It's getting close. Yeah, right there. Make sure to fall on some leaves. And there's my bundle on fire. All right, so this has been Michigan Survival. That was a boat drill during a hurricane. My hearth board literally broke in half while I was doing it. I also broke out one of my depressions. I had to recarve all that. But it really pays to carry one tinder bundle with you in your rucksack, haversack, whatever it is. Because even during a hurricane, you can still get a fire going. Appreciate your views. Calm Sea Sport. See you in the next one. Take care. You know, as I walk out of here, And the wind is just really powerful and the hurricane has been upon us for a while now. And I'm walking without a headlamp, really in tune with my environment, listening for branches that are cracking so I can make sure I can roll out of the way, not get hurt. You know, I really appreciate all of nature's moods.
This is a rare mood. And I love it. I love it all. It's such a mysterious night.